Hey YouTube, it's your boy Daddy AZ here, iPod Jailbreak Hacker, otherwise known as Only Use Me Tomahawks, and some of y'all may know me as Easy. Like I always say, to the black, to the blue, to my avatar and my YouTube channel, yeah, buddy. So this is Mother Russia, as you can see right here. I am paying Metro. Uh, what's the name of the title? Metro Last Light. And as you can see, we're in Russia right now. So, <laughs> um, this is Metro The Last Light, uh, good game now, some of y'all made to play Metro, what it was, 2033, um, this game <laughs> is not for children, uh, it'll make you crap yourself, make you piss your pants, now, um, a little word of advice, if you wanna play this game, do not play this game on a big ass TV, especially on the Xbox 360, the graphics, it would get you disoriented that to a point that you don't know where the hell you at, um, especially through a lot of stuff on here. But um, play it on a smaller TV, like a 24-inch TV, 32-inch. Anything higher than the 32-inch, you just see a lot of the, you know, grain and all that other crap. The smaller your TV, the better it looks. Um, as you can see right here, it didn't look like this on my TV when I was playing it. It just had a lot of fuzz towards it. Cause I am playing it on a um, 48 inch TV and a 42 inch TV and stuff like that. So the bigger the TV, the less you're going to get a chance to experience. You might jump and stuff like that, but you're not going to get that experience like you want. Now, this game is fun. Um, I never played Metro 2033. I seen gameplays of it. I liked it. It was just something that I didn't think I was going to really get into. People were saying, go out, get this. I seen the way how the graphics and stuff looked on it. So I said, you know what? I'm going to go pick this up. As you see my unboxing on it. Um, I picked it up. I liked it. It has, I like the details that they put on towards it. The more in-game, in-game physicality that you can do on it is amazing what they did with this game. To the point that everything that you do, you have to constantly, constantly keep doing it. For example, my flashlight is dying. So I use this little power generator thing to re-power up my flashlight. So I gotta re-pump it up to get my flashlight completely bright again and stuff like that. You do the same thing with air guns. You get guns that's basically like BB guns, um, air guns, that you pump it up and you shoot these little pellets. Now they do give you a lot of customization and if you pre-order like I did at GameStop, you'll get a bonus, uh, what is it? golden bullets that allows you to get uh purchase more you know weapons upgrades and stuff like that they give you a customized gun that you can use in game and they also give you um another bonus let me check what was the bonus oh um ranger mode that's just like the super hardest difficulty for the game so that's one of the things they do give you but is this a game that you can play around with family members Hell no. <clears throat> the reason why I say hell no, because they put so much stuff into this game that it shouldn't even be rated M. It should be rated MA. Now, the reason why I say rated MA, because you can get lap dances on it. Yeah, buddy. Like they say in Russia, you get the lap what you pay for. <laughs> but yeah, um, you get lap dances. Look at this. Stab him in the neck. This is the old daddy easy when it comes to knifing. Wanna play some Call of Duty now? Look, knife me in your neck. I'm gonna knife you. Turn around. Knife you. Uh -huh. Then I'm gonna go after this dude right here. I'm gonna knife him. Come back around. Knife him. What? Knife him. <laughs> and that's how I normally play games. Uh, suppressed weapon with a knife. And that's how I normally play my games. And during the whole gameplay, I used my, uh, my revolver with the silencer. And basically, the only thing I did during the whole gameplay, really, I've used throwing knives and my um my knife just basically stab and throw at people and that's how i normally play my games <laughs> on many games that have like that now the reason why i like this game simple fact is they have throwing knives on here that was one of the big must that i like um the reason why i shot up there was because that throwing knife was not going to get up there and i was going to even try to waste the knife basically to try to throw at them um but the game is fun you might want to play, play this game in a stealthy way. The harder the difficulty you get, the less you're going to be able to get ammunition. Now, when you start playing the game on easy and medium, you'll be able to find ammunition like all the time. As you can see, I'm just shooting because I'm playing this on medium. So, I'm basically getting all the 
you know ammunition and stuff that I need now the reason why is this I'm going to replay this game over it's just I wanted to end this game to the review and basically tell you what it's about but each game setting mode that you go on it gets harder and harder and less ammunition you're going to get and you want to play this game more stealthy now during this gameplay and many other games that I played I'm always a stealthy player I like to go for uh, stealth kills because you get a lot more achievements by stealth killing um, so I do use my throwing knife a lot inside the game. Um, I mean, it's just fun. I'm a big Call of Duty game gamer, so I use tomahawks and stuff like that, throwing knives. Those that know me when I was playing COD 4, um, Black Ops, uh, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 2. Um, I've been a big knifer. I just recently started using guns recently on Black Ops 2. For the simple fact they had a new line of guns and stuff in it, so I really want to use that. Sorry about that, guys. Somebody was giving me a phone call, so I'm sorry about that. But yeah, um, I've done a lot of stuff, uh, you know, a lot of gameplays and stuff like that with the knife and things like that. But um, let's get more back into this game instead of Call of Duty stuff right here. But as you can see right here, nice game. I had be able to do a lot of things on it. Um, I believe right here I throw a knife at him or I shoot him. I'm not completely sure what I do to him, but I know I kill him. I'm not sure if I shoot him or I throw a knife. But do I like this game? Yes, I love this game. This game is awesome. Something that you're not going to play around with kids around. Um, they do have nudity in in this. Uh, you do get lap dances and stuff on it. But how do I rate this game? How much score do I give this game? Do I like it? Yes, I love this game. Wish they made more. I give this game a 9 out of 10 with a kick-ass seal of approval. And I will catch you guys in my next video. So it's your boy Daddy Easy here. I bought Jarvis Hackle. I'm using Tomahawks. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.